Hi friends, you are watching Gate Helpline and in this video we will see question number 10 from Gate Zone 16 question paper. Please click the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to get all the latest updates from our channel. So let's start question number 10. So friends, question number 10 is a queue is implemented using an array such that NQ and DQ operations are performed efficiently. Which one of the following statements is correct? N refers to the number of items in the queue and the options are A. Both operations can be performed in big of one time. B. At most one operation can be performed in big of one time. But the worst case time for the other operations will be omega n. C. The worst case time complexity of both operations will be omega n. And D. Worst case time complexity for both operations will be omega log n. So friends, now we will see explanation to this question. In this question, we are implementing the queue with the help of an array. And we know that array is a static data structure. And in static data structure, the size of the array is fixed. That is defined earlier. So to fetch a particular location in array, we know that it's going to take constant time only. So that constant time will be big of one. So we will start one by one and see what is NQ and DQ operation in this implementation. So first NQ operation. So in this check whether array is full or not. If array is full then we stop else we enter the element in the end of the array and to access the end of the array we earlier know that which position will be because the length of the array is fixed. So it will take big of one time and for DQ operation check arrays whether empty or not. If array is empty then we stop else delete the element from the front of the array and increment the head value. Pointed to the starting element of the array is called as head and this will take big of one time only because we are implementing it with the help of an array and as we discussed earlier array is in static data structure. So for array implementation of Q and Q and DQ operations takes big of one time. So friends as per our explanation answer to this question is option A that is both operations can be performed in big of one time. So friends thanks for watching our video please like subscribe our channel and share our videos to appreciate our work. If you have any doubt or question, please comment below and keep watching our channel for videos like this.